Hey there, so you've connected your bank in every dollar. That's awesome. In this quick tutorial, I'll show you how to track those transactions in your budget. When you first connect your bank, it usually takes 24 to 48 hours for transactions to start streaming in, but you may see them immediately depending on your bank. New transactions will show up in your budget after they've been cleared by your bank. So there are two places where you can find your transactions. First tap on budget. You'll see a blue coin with a number in it. That's the total number of transactions that are ready to track. Green transactions are income, money coming in. Black transactions are expenses, money going out. From there, it's easy to just drag and drop your transactions into the right budget item. For example, you drag your paycheck transaction to your income budget item, or drag the 7-Eleven transaction to your gas budget item. It's that easy to stay on top of your spending. Then just tap remaining to see how much you have left to spend for the budget item this month. The other place you can see transactions is on your transactions tab. Grayed out transactions are the ones you've already tracked, but the bolded ones still need to be tracked to your budget item. Just tap the transaction, select your budget item you want to track it to, and tap done. Once you start tracking transactions, every dollar gets smarter and starts recommending budget items based on how you spent your money. If you agree with those recommendations, you can track the transaction with a single tap. So fast, so easy. Sometimes you need to split a transaction across multiple budget items. For example, maybe you use this Amazon transaction to buy clothes and birthday gifts. To split it, just tap the transaction and pick the budget items you'd like to split it between. Then just type in how much you spent for each budget item. You don't even have to get out a calculator. The app does the math for you. If you want to delete a transaction from your budget, just tap it and select delete transaction. But if you ever delete a transaction by mistake, you can find it on your transactions tab and restore it to your budget. If you don't want transactions to stream in from one of your accounts anymore, go over to accounts. Just tap on the account you want to turn off and switch the slider to off. Now, transactions from your account won't stream automatically into your budget. If you run into any questions or issues with your transactions, we are here to help you. You can reach out to our customer success team anytime for any issue right from the app. Now that's how you track your transactions with Bank Connect. Now you can budget with confidence knowing you'll never miss a transaction. Happy budgeting.